channel what's up what is up you guys what's up how y'all doing welcome 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 to my channel if it's your first time here you're definitely welcome make sure to subscribe and like all of my videos and if you're a regular subscriber what's up how you're doing let me know in the comment section down below yeah so today it's going to be all about positivity from the title you already know what i'm going to be talking about and um let me just make this known this topic is not only going to be for i know it seems like it's directed to girls only but no because i feel we're all human beings and sometimes we just need some of these tips in life to go forward public service announcements i'm not where i want to be i'm not i'm still trying to build myself up i'm still trying to be better okay yeah so i'm also trying to learn these tips i'm sharing with you guys these techniques these mechanisms i'm also trying to learn them yeah so uh i don't know i'm talking too much without further ado let's just jump right into the video yeah so these days i don't know the way the way it is now concerning um how someone should look or how someone should be like someone's body size someone's um skin color someone's facial i i don't know it's really really too too much and i feel like it affects most of us because not everybody has that you know that high level of confidence or what have you so i feel we need some of all these tips to like um build our confidence and this is going to be mostly directed to plus size girls like me because growing up it's not been easy it's not been easy you know always always been called fat anywhere you go you'll be like ah yeah, fat too. Especially when I was younger, it was worse. Like, she's too fat. My secondary school too, you know, always being like you're just, you're just the. I don't just know. It's just very, very sad. So if you want to, you know, build your confidence a bit, or you want to start working on yourself, or what have you, just come with me. Come, let's just get right into the video. So the first thing. You do not owe anyone a perfect body or a perfect image. You do not owe anyone that at all. The way you are, the way God made you, you are beautiful, you are you are handsome in that way. You do not owe anyone, okay, your nose has to be shaped that way. Um, um, you, you have to have um, this hourglass um, figure. You do not owe anyone a perfect body. So do not, do, don't start, I don't know killing yourself because you feel like you also if your friends or if someone doesn't like the way you look the person has to be in the trash can you guys know this already okay so do not try to start if you want to fix up yourself fix up yourself for yourself don't start fixing up yourself for someone else because it doesn't make sense it basically means you're living your life for someone else yeah so do not you don't owe anybody a perfect body okay because if you start feeling like okay okay let me say for instance i have a boyfriend and I, i'm like she doesn't like the way i look maybe i'm too big my tummy is too big my this one is too big he doesn't like this he doesn't like that so then i have to start fixing up myself because of him that's not just it it's not nice so let me just tell you you do not owe anyone a perfect body size a perfect body shape a perfect face a perfect skin color you are beautiful the way you are if if you do not like the way you look then work for yourself don't work for someone else don't fix up yourself for someone else because that's not cool you're only destroying yourself okay yeah the second thing is that um these days we use social media to define ourselves we use the things that we see in public or the things that we see in general to define ourselves say um, uh, um, some pictures you see on magazines or um, some some photos you see on Instagram Twitter whatever maybe or someone you see on a TV show you'll be like oh my god I wish I was like that person no don't feel that way let me just tell you something what you're seeing that picture you're seeing is not what you're seeing I don't know how to elaborate this very well for instance here yeah, you see someone on the cover of a magazine that's not that person's real face do you understand that person we have wrinkles we have acne we have scars we have stretch marks we have mentioned it we have everything so don't start saying you just want to be you just want to look like that person you're seeing on social media then you start killing yourself because you don't look like that you don't look like that person people 
show us what they want us to see the society shows us what they want us to see so don't start um killing yourself because you're seeing one girl her body is you know all shining it looks like she doesn't have stretch marks or she doesn't even have any spots it's a lie that photo has been retouched by maybe the photographer or something so you really do not have to kill yourself over what you see on social i swear these days people are really really killing themselves over what they see on social media and it's not even nice at all we really need to you know stop that we are perfect the way we are like i mentioned before so yeah stop using social media to dictate how you are supposed to look yeah and this one is very very hard for most persons even for myself but i'm working towards that and that is building your mind i have a friend who always tell me that everything starts from your mind for instance you know how will i put it now in your mind you're saying oh my god oh my god i'm just i'm i'm not just i'm not just it my body is not just perfect then your mind is just going to i don't know how the how it works but you know maybe we have some let me say i don't know i don't know for instance maybe there's some sort of water inside our mind some sort of water inside our mind that when we tell our minds that um we don't have the perfect body that water runs down to every part of our body making us feel some type of way making us feel so bad about how we look or about our body something like that so yeah we have to build our mind to be positive at all times we have to build our mind to say yes i'm, I'm, I'm beautiful yes i'm handsome yes i look good yes i you you know what i'm talking about it's all about positivity you know so we have to build our mind i know like this is very hard because i'm also working towards this same tip so uh it's it's not easy but it's one step at a time trust me it's one step at a time if not i don't think you'd see me yeah right now doing this video or filming a video or what have you or even or even posting pictures yeah the next one is i don't know how to tag this but i'm going to say it that way body confidence or you trying to build your body confidence doesn't mean you should start um you know being off offensive towards others because in the society now it's not just plus size girls that have you know that have issues or what have you even skinny girls i mean if you're if you're too skinny someone is complaining if you're too thick if you're too fat someone is complaining we're just gonna die we're gonna die in this country or in this world that we are in because not nothing you do or i don't know it's not just perfect to people to people because if you're like too skinny they'll be like <laughs> This one is too skinny or she doesn't eat if you're fat you say ah this one is fat so she eats a lot so it's like too 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 complicated so what i'm trying to um pass out under this tip is that because okay let me use myself okay now i'm actually thick or i'm big so because i'm big and i want to you know try to boost up myself or something i'll not start looking down on people that are skinny or start looking down on other like I don't know it doesn't really make sense because I'm trying to build my body confidence doesn't mean I should try to bring someone else down I don't know if you all get me but for instance now I have a friend who is you know like skinny kind of and I'm big like this I should not start saying oh you're so skinny it's not like I'm perfect I'm not perfect either because I'm sure my friend could also say Oh, you're so fat and I'm, I'm going to get hurt right so I, because you're trying to build your body confidence doesn't mean you, you should start and um, bringing somebody down okay build your confidence it's good to build your body confidence but then do not bring someone else down while doing that because I'm sure maybe most of us do these things but we don't even know that we do it so let's not do it and uh, I don't want to make this video so long so the last one for today is feel sexy in your body like there was a time i posted a picture i'm going to put it up here here somewhere there yeah there's a time i posted a picture and everybody was like oh my god shalom oh my god shalom oh my god shalom like the picture i would say the picture broke the, the internet don't mind me but like the picture i don't know people were just surprised i got hate comments i got good comments at the same time some person some of my friends were like even you know so happy that i had the mind to take such photo it's not like the photo has and there's no big deal here but i showed 
some um, parts of my body my stretch marks showed in the picture I got so many hate comments like why are you showing us your tummy you have stretch marks they're so ugly you have a big tummy you have fat arms you have this you have that so many hate comments you know and this boils down back to building up you know your mind if I don't build up my mind if I don't have that I don't know if I don't just build up my mind I'm going to feel so 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 bad you know oh they said my stomach is this way oh they said my arms are this way oh they said I have this one I have that one so I don't know if you're fat if you're skinny feel sexy in your body like it's your body I don't know wear what is going to make you wear what you want okay you don't really need anyone's opinion wear what you want wear what you like as long as you know you're not doing anything wrong you're not hurting anybody by doing what you're doing then do it i mean wear what you want if you want to show this part of your body show it if you want to show that part of your body show it it's your body and nobody has any right whatsoever to come and tell you to do anything okay and i have this um last tip for you guys embrace your body embrace your body embrace what you look like embrace what you look like because I don't know for instance I have a big head everybody knows I have it my head is like very large I don't know but then I know I have a big brain inside there do you get me I have a very big head but then it's it's how I am I can't I be should I use compressor to compress the head <laughs> I don't know but I can't compress my head to to be smaller or something it's it's how it is and that that is what makes me beautiful my big head makes me beautiful before I, I don't used to like the way my lips looked because they're like low-key somehow very small I don't know but I'm gonna die with my lips like this it's gonna remain like this. I, I I won't go and start doing surgery for my lips to become fuller like maybe Kylie Jenner or something it's this is how it's meant to be and it's just it has to be like that so I have to embrace it you know wear all the colors of lipstick I want and feel cute with my lips my tiny lips like that you know my big head and everything so yeah that's the end of this video I just really hope that we learned one or two things embrace your body you're beautiful you're handsome you're fine you're pretty you're a pretty queen yes <laughs> you're a pretty queen like me we are all pretty we are all handsome I'm not handsome but you all are handsome everybody is fine so embrace yourself you know I don't know takes it takes time yeah it's not just a fast process but you're gonna get there trust me you're going to get there I'm also working towards mine I'm not where I want to be yet sometimes I, I do feel down I won't lie I, I, I do feel down because I'm human but then I'm also working towards it so let's all let's all try to work towards our goal if you don't like how you look change it and change it for yourself don't change it because mr okoronko said that you are looking like a pig don't change it because mrs stella said this one don't don't i don't know but change your body because you want to change it or change how you look like because you want to do it for yourself because you want to do it to make yourself happy because sometimes when we even after you have finished changing your body you may not even like how you look like so yeah i just really really hope that i've said this thing before but i hope that we learned one or two things from today's video so thank you guys for watching thank you for watching i hope you liked this video give it a thumbs up if you liked it if you did not like it give it a thumbs up make sure to share this video to everybody you know in this life to your let me not start but anyways thank you for watching do not forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video peace out Bye.